Hello, it's Tom with Digital Foundry. Now this will bring back strong memories of the Xbox 360's launch. This is Call of Duty 2, a 2005 release from Infinity Ward that really set the template for the games later to come in the series. It's maybe a tad bare bones by today's standards, but it's now fully playable on Xbox One via back compat support. And the good news here is it's much, much smoother to play this way. So what are we seeing here? Well Call of Duty 2 always targeted a full 60fps back in the day, but as with later games in the series on Xbox 360, it also double buffered its output. What this means is, whenever the game couldn't reach its 167 millisecond render time for a frame, it temporarily hard locked to 30fps instead, and then rose up to 60fps again when it was ready. For a game like Call of Duty, this wasn't necessarily a good thing and created a jarring sensation as it switched between these two refresh modes, creating the effect that the game was slowing down whenever you were faced with any real action. In fact, revisiting Call of Duty on Xbox 360 today, the frequency of these drops is pretty startling. But fortunately, if you're putting your old disc into an Xbox One, most of these drops are eliminated outright, leaving you with a clean 60fps line most of the way. Now you do get the odd hiccup here and there, and this opening Stalingrad campaign mission shows Xbox One only really buckles with lots of enemies on screen, but it's rare and only dips to around 55fps or so. But crucially, the alpha based effects that gave the 360 so much trouble are no longer an issue with the newer machine's more powerful GPU. In terms of the core graphical content, it's still running at the same resolution of course, around 720p, and expectedly the Xbox One visuals are a nigh on match for its delivery on Xbox 360, but that performance is better by a pretty stark margin. No more lurching frame rates, and where there is a drop, it's usually settled within a few seconds. Anyway, that's all for now. We have a suite of other Xbox 360 back compat supported titles tested on Xbox One on this channel, and more to come in the future as well. Do like and subscribe if you want to see more, and until next time, thanks for watching.